So today we're going to discuss work coffee cup etiquette. It's one of them little eccentricities that we bring from home with us that we all have that we don't like to admit to, but we all do it quite a lot. So my coffee mug at work, exhibit number one. It's quite large, I like it on the morning. Breakfast service mug. Exhibit number two, morning coffee mug. Slightly smaller, morning coffee. Everyone brings theirs from home. It's part of them, they bring it with them. We like to use it, we don't like anybody else to use it. However, when, when a tradesman comes to site, the plumber, the builder, the window cleaner, anybody like that, it's nice to offer them a coffee. And we do, we offer them a coffee, then suddenly we think, oh no, what mug are we going to put it in? Because I don't want to put it in mine. I don't want anyone else drinking out of my mug. And you think, who's not working today? Who's not working? Who, whose mug can I give them? He starts searching, you know, I've not, they're not in today, so it's going to be their mug. But then, what happens if they find out? Are they then going to give your mug away to someone? It's a minefield. And then, there's also the novelty mug. It's usually something that someone's been given for Christmas by a friend or something like that. It's usually something that can't stay in the cupboard at home in case your mum brings your nan around and finds out it's in there and it gets given to her or she sees it by accident. So, and that looks something like this. So one of these little heat sensitive bad boys with this fella on. All offices, kitchens, anywhere really, will have novelty mugs. And this is usually given to someone who is new or to a delivery man that you have a bit of banter with, but you have to be really careful that this mug doesn't get seen by the customers. And that is part of the fun. Selecting your work mug can also be very important. So take this one. I can't be trusted at B&M. Ironically, the lady that this cup belongs to, I can't think of anybody geographically who lives further from a shop. But she likes it. It's glittery, it says a lot about her. This next one, Dave's work mug. I wouldn't drink out of that. It's too thick around the rim and it's got a pattern on it. It's got a little ridge pattern on it. Not for me. We all have the coffee mug eccentricity at work. It needs to stop. It won't stop. I certainly won't be stopping, but I think it needs to stop. So put a picture of your work mug in the comments below. Uh, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.